cut out, ready to offer up to the boat and see how it's going to look. Um, so we just want to do a 5 eighths. But we flush it up with the bottom of the rails. You can see we're sticking up pretty prominent. And I took my pencil and just kind of carefully marked that line. So that lets me know the bottom of my curve. Now I'm going to... Well, uh, I don't have a carver's vise, so I have a block and a couple of screws for a clamp and uh, we'll carve it with it. I'm going to start out with my plane, hand plane, and rough shape it with it, and then uh, after I get fairly close with the hand plane, close to that line, and kind of somewhat, then I'll go and attach it to the boat, and uh, then I'll use a, it's just a regular welder's grinder, but a 24 grit disc on it shaping with it down to fairly close to the rails and then I'll use a random order. I've got the other pressed up pretty close. Well, it's supposed to look something like this. Mm, and, I can't uh, see it very good because of the sun. I need to go the other way maybe. Well, it's supposed to look something like this and uh, once you get your profile then I took compass, set it to the width of the rails, and I drew a line so now the, the bottom of it is curved as well underneath. So if you get down and look across the, you can see this curved up. Possibly, hard to tell with the light. If you get down kind of level with the rails, you can see that from here to here is our magical 5 8 rise that we was talking about, so my math wasn't too far. The miracle of modern mathematics wasn't too far off. Mm -hmm. But, uh, okay, so I'm going to go ahead and shape this one, and uh, we will see how it goes. <clears throat> Am I supposed to record this part? Yeah, you can record a little bit, but I don't care. Okay, I don't know. battery so go until you can't go no further okay, I guess. So, uh, I'm going to sculpt that down to that line and when I get it pretty close then we'll come back and when I'm putting it on the boat and kind of shape it a little bit more. So. Alrighty. Thank you very much.